Hi, this is Matt and this is a short video on how to download Facebook Messenger conversations. So I'm right here on my Filmmaking Lifestyle Facebook page, uh, but wherever you are on Facebook, all you need to do is come up to the top uh, to the account section. So click right here on, on the picture of you that will be in the top right. And we're going to go on settings and privacy. So click on settings and privacy, then click settings. So that will now take us to the settings and privacy section. And right at the top here, we've got account center. So there's a few different ways you can get to this uh, next section, but I'm gonna show you this way. So click on see more in account center. So I'm right here on desktop. You can do the same on mobile as well, of course. And so about halfway down, we've got account settings and we've got your information and permissions. So if we click on that one, now what we want to do is we want to click on download your information here. So you can look at the pass requests, there's a few different options here, but the one you want to click on is this button that's kind of tucked away at the top here, download or transfer information. And we're going to select the bottom option if we want to choose messages, so we can click on specific types of information. And this will open up a new window. So we've got all these different options here that we can actually select. So we can select all if we want to download all of our Facebook activity. That's going to be overkill uh, in a lot of cases. Uh, you can see some of the options that you can download, everything from posts to friends, followers. Uh, essentially, all the activity that you've done on Facebook is readily available for you to download. Uh, the more that you add here, obviously, the, the longer it's going to take to download later on. Uh, but for the purposes of this video, we just want to click on messages here. So this says may take longer to download, obviously, depending on how many messages you've got. But this option will allow you to download all of your Facebook Messenger messages. So we click on next at the bottom. And now we have the option to download to device or download uh, transfer even to a destination. So transfer to destination, uh, we can select, if you click here, uh, we can, we've got the option for Google Drive. If you've got Google Drive or Dropbox is an option as well. So that will just transfer directly to your account and you can view or download from there. And if we go back, we can just download to a device. So. Uh, what we're next going to do, so this will just put it on your computer, so I'm downloading directly to my computer in this case. Uh, so for security, you'll only have four days to download your files, it says here. Uh, and we're going to set a date range. So depending on the messages, um, which kind of messages you want, maybe you want all of them. Uh, this warning again, it's going to take a while because obviously it's potentially a lot of messages. If you're just looking for messages from the last month, uh, you can go there, last three months there, uh, and six months. So you've got a few different options. Uh, there's custom as well, so you can set a date range there. I'm just going to go for uh, six months and click save. And then we can actually notify. So choose an email address that you want to notify, that you want to have it actually sent to. Uh, so format wise, so we've got HTML or JSON. So uh, JSON is just a way to deliver data um, and HTML. Uh, well, it's the web uh, programming language essentially. So uh, we're just gonna go with HTML here. That's a good safe option. And media quality wise, uh, so you can go for high, medium or low. This kind of depends on what you're actually downloading. If you're just downloading messages, uh, it's probably not gonna matter. You can just keep medium. You might want higher if you've got images or you want to keep things in high quality. And then we can just click on create files at the bottom. And what that will do is just Facebook will work its magic and the pending download is going through right now. Uh, so we've requested this, uh, the information is being prepared for download. So when that's all ready, you'll actually be able to download it here. It's, um, it's not gone through yet. It hasn't all uh, been put together by Facebook. And you'll also get an email sent directly to the email address that you set earlier. So whatever email account you've got, uh, on hand for this particular Facebook account, you'll receive an email with your download and you can just download it directly there to your computer or laptop. So hopefully you found this video on how to download Facebook Messenger messages useful and hopefully it's been helpful for you.